The making of a eunuch. <sighs> also known as the emotional terrorism of Oprah and Harry. <laughs> Prince <laughs> Harry opens up. I refuse to call him a prince anymore. In his new Apple TV series with Oprah, the me you can't see. What words have you heard around mental health? Crazy. Can't keep it together. Here's the thing. Another thing that's been totally co-opted and destroyed is mental health. So on the heels of a pandemic in which the poor suffered the most of anybody and had the most mental health crisis, small businesses got destroyed. I think there was an article that a third of restaurants in L.A. got shut down during the pandemic. Permanently. Permanently. You're seeing the destruction of our middle class, small businesses in particular. You've had people who haven't had their kids going to school. And then you're going to parade out Prince Harry and Oprah and all of these rich, famous celebrities as the people who are the face of the suffering post-pandemic? This makes me want to kill myself. <laughs> I'm thinking about it and I'm like, if you're going to kill yourself, call the suicide hotline. Why, why does this bother me so much? Because... A lot of times it's like, okay, we know Oprah's story is like horrifying. And She's so is ho- Prince Harry. And and so it's like all of these things, but it's like something has changed in our cu- cl- cultural climate right now. We, I just have no tolerance to be preached to from any of these people about their struggles their and suffering. Well, what's changed too is that it feels emotionally manipulative yeah so there's Mm -hmm. something psychotic about this and you can't put a finger on it because it's weaponized victimhood Mm -hmm. so you're gonna say you're gonna point and say hey this makes me feel weird and i don't really know why and it feels like you're just monetizing victimhood and this is a cash grab and then people will yell at you and tell you that you don't have a heart or any empathy and that they're trying to do good and start a conversation about mental health. The conversation started about mental health. Have you not heard the way people talk? It's all in the language of therapy now. Everybody talks about their trauma and their victimhood and their PTSD. I just can't go get over the fact, too, that Harry went from this, like, badass Apache helicopter pilot to a dude talking on a podcast about his daddy issues and whining about Joe Rogan and how Joe Rogan needs to shut up. And if you come for Joe Rogan, I will come for you. (laughs) I will go to war for that man. (laughs) That guy has held the center Uh for all of us. Uh He's the only reason we're not all dressed up for the woke army. (laughs) 